Okay, 50 episodes, 50 episodes. What was my favorite part? So it blows my mind that we are celebrating our 50th episode. It's been such a journey on Agents of S.H.I.E.L.D. and I have so many episodes that I love. It's kind of like Sophie's Choice trying to pick one. But of course I'm going to be absolutely selfish as an actor should be and say the May on May fight scene. That was so much fun, it was so awesome. I love doing it because it was just more of me. Okay, I'm gonna be, stop being sarcastic here. <laughs> but I did really like that fight scene. Okay, wow, my favorite moment. Brett's favorite moment is kissing me. Right? <laughs> That's what you were gonna say, right? Yes, that is that is what I was I was gonna say. I was actually gonna say uh, my favorite uh, moment was was uh, with Ian, but you, but you didn't you. But I'm a good kisser. Yeah, right? and we also had that kissing kissing moment in the closet. Um, well, there was a moment in there that we shared, and it was it was his favorite moment. It was it so, was okay. it was your favorite. It was a Just be it honest. was a favorite moment. It was a favorite moment. Thanks, Chloe. I think seeing the moments where some of those original people who first showed up on this journey with me, the incredible Brett Dalton and what he's done, creating one of the most amazing villains in the Marvel Universe, in Grant Ward, Chloe Bennett, Sky, now Daisy, Ming, creating a now iconic, powerful woman character who's a role model. Ian DeCastecker show up and deliver this character that moves me every time I see him. And the same with Elizabeth Henstridge taking these two science nerds that we could barely understand and create these incredible dimensional characters. That's the thing I'm most moved by and proud of and honored to be part of in our 50 episodes so far. Well, my favorite moment was of course meeting Fitz and Ian, but our first scene I feel like it was very fun and very memorable. I was in a pink shirt and I think you were in, well I actually forget what you were wearing, but it, it was very fun and I just, you know, felt like, ah, oh, this is good. We're a little duo. What was your first moment, Ian? My favorite first favorite, moment favorite. Yeah. was when I met a specific girl for the first time <sighs> and she was so smart yeah. And funny, mm -hmm. and beautiful, um, you know, and I just, I remember the first time I stroked her hairy little face, uh, you know, and that's why Maggie is just, it's the, meeting you has been the greatest thing about S.H.I.E.L.D. Um, I had just started working on S.H.I.E.L.D. and I, it was my first time working with this guy named Ian. He, uh, it was good because Fitz and Mac, the chemistry that they have together was wonderful. It was just easy working with them and it was a lot of fun, but I guess it was a great moment for me because it also started a friendship that I have with him. He's a great guy and he's a good friend of mine, so that's moment number one. One of the most important moments for me was when Marissa and I were allowed to ride in the flying hydraulic Lola. Uh, we were doing a skydive sequence with Sky at the time and Coulson. And they had rigged this apparatus. The only way I can describe it is you will just show it right now. Cool. And then, so we got to get into th that vehicle and basically they, we flew around on the green screen and, you know, it was one of the perks of being in charge. I have two favorite parts. Am I allowed to have two favorite parts? Hey, um... Remember, remember that time um, I built a sandwich, and you, you were asking about May and the cavalry. Yeah, I do. That was awesome. It was awesome. Hey, um, remember, remember that time. Um, but all my favorite parts don't have to. They're not all about you. Okay. <laughs> That's not true. They are. Okay. They're all you. Oh, okay. All right. All right. Until great. you went all hard on us. <laughs> channeling Chris Farley. Oh, okay. So I'm gonna finish this. Oh, okay. okay. All right. I'll love, see you on you. set. Okay. Love you. Right. Okay. Bye. I love you. Bye. Flowing so. your kiss. It's a hydra. Kiss. Sorry. Ever since you went all hydra, it's been so weird. It was very fun shooting 
words turn to evil. It was a, a scene that we uh, eagerly anticipated for a long time and it was a very gratifying on the day to see Brett sort of step into that role and mercilessly murder a few people. Um, anything else, babe? You s stole the one that I was gonna do. Which one was that? Ward's turn. Uh. So you stole my moment, as I am stealing yours right now. Kind of when I turned into Daisy Johnson, probably was one of my favorite moments because that's crazy. Because when I got cast in this show, it was for like a degenerate computer hacker who lived in her van. Um, so the fact that now I get to, I was technically the first um, female superhero with powers who happens to be also Asian. Um, that's kind of awesome and, and crazy to be able to kind of pave the way um, for female superheroes like that, so that's pretty cool. Also, every moment with Ian DeCastiger. I heard that. And Brett Dalton. Ian and Chloe started playing pranks on each other, and we were shooting a snowy scene. And so we had a bunch of, you know, just snow lying around uh, the studio. Uh, Ian decided to take a heap full of snow and just dump it in Chloe's toilet in her trailer. And so I think in retaliation, Chloe took Covered his car. Covered his car in snow, and also maybe the inside. Thankfully, mm -hmm. it was a rental. Don't tell the rental company mm -hmm. that, though. And then she murdered his dog, <laughs> which was a, it was, a, it took a dark turn, but I mean, a great prank. I mean, she got him. I you would know? say that's our favorite moment yeah. of the entire Yeah, that was Ian's dead dog just sitting show. there. Yeah. Um, I remember the first morning. Uh, it's about 6.15. Everyone gets to set. It's the first shot. It's Ward walking up to the bus, the big giant airplane. Of course, there is no big giant airplane. It's just a big empty hangar. And Brett uh, comes walking across as Ward uh, and looks up at it and has this look of amazement on his face that he's gonna join S.H.I.E.L.D. And I think we all had the same look of amazement, largely because we were looking at a big empty hangar and that somehow in the middle of big emptiness, there was gonna be magic. And when it was all put together and you go back and look at the pilot and you see this beautiful, gigantic airplane it speaks to the magic of the show. It speaks to how we all have, for 50 episodes, had an opportunity to learn about S.H.I.E.L.D. and to learn about these characters through unbelievably great writing, a terrific cast, and the best crew that anyone could ever possibly hope for. I bet she kisses you if I do this. <laughs> <laughs> I think she loves me more than you. She's like, yeah, Max. <laughs> <laughs>